All right, we're going to do a little swing check here for Bryson. So um, starting off, great posture. Everything looks very good. Um, if you draw lines on his feet um, his and down the center of the club face, you will see that he is aimed slightly right of the fairway there. So you can hit a draw back into the fairway. All right, take the club back. Now, this looks excessively underplane, but it's really not. It's just mostly the camera angle. He does take the club inside of his hands here, um, but it, it's more exaggerated because of that angle of the camera. As he gets up to the top, he's got great shoulder rotation. He's loading into his right leg um, while keeping his hips rotating. Um, as he gets up to the top, he's going to start to drop that club down now. This is where the magic happens. So left hip starts to clear out of the way. Hands start to bring the club down. Keeps the club behind him and gets it immediately parallel to the primary swing plane line. And then from here, now that he's got his right elbow connected to the right side of his body, um, he is going to really start to unleash the hip turn and the shoulder turn and the shoulder tilt. Look at how far inside this driver is attacking the golf ball. That angle is very much inside. And that's what a lot of people don't realize is everybody tries to swing on a straight driver path because they will think that that's going to make them hit the ball straight. But these guys all have some form of either inside out or outside to in. So he's going to start to continue turning and tilting the body. The club is going to attack from the inside. Look at his, how far his right shoulder is down compared to his left shoulder. And then look at how far his hips have rotated. You can almost see his left pocket. Now from here, he's going to explode out. He's going to extend his arms away from his spine, continuing that shoulder tilt. The weight is starting to shift into his left leg. Boom. And then you'll see that exit path of the golf club is just over the left shoulder. That's exactly where it should be. And that ball takes out, takes off out to the right, just like he had planned. Clears that tree and starts to draw back to the fairway. Um, overall, you know, he gets everything loaded onto his left side here in the finish. Overall, obviously, it's a great swing. Um, and what you'll find is that all these tour pros have uh, just a few fundamentals that they all do almost identically. Um, and that is hip turn, shoulder turn, and shoulder tilt. When those numbers are good... Typically, the swing is going to be pretty, pretty solid. I hope that helps. As always, aim small, swing smooth. Peace.